All right, good afternoon, crafts fans. This is Scott from Paradise Crafts. Back at you for another one of my go-to sessions. Hopefully it'll be a nice, smooth one. So today I wanted to talk about scalability of this strategy. So I play it at the green chip level, $25 level, but there's no reason you can't scale it down all the way to a $5 table and play $100 units. So basically it's pretty straightforward. Let's do $5 units today. I have no idea how that's gonna work. All right, so there is 100 in the red. And what are we gonna need? We probably need the same amount of white chips. So we'll do 20 in white. So not quite the same, because we normally start with 25. All right, so there's 20 in white. So there's 100, all right? 80, 25, 50, 75, $80, and 20 in singles. So the only thing I'm not sure about is on a $5 table, what the VIG is. I can't imagine the VIG is less than a dollar because I don't think I've seen any chips on the table less than a dollar. So I'm thinking you still got to pay a dollar VIG, which is kind of hurtful at that level, but let's do it. All right, so single unit, $5. We're in for 100, we're looking for, so it's basically 20 times your single unit, right, is your bankroll. So 20 times 5 is 100, so 20 times 10 is 200, 20 times 15 is 300, 20 times 25 is 500, and 20 times 100, if you wanted to play that, would be a $2,000 bankroll. So 100, 200, 300. 500 or two thousand dollars so that would be the different bankroll levels to be the same as what I play at the $25 level and again your your profit you're still looking for only 20 percent 20 percent so you know on a hundred dollars you're looking for 20 bucks All right 10 percent is ten dollars so you're looking for 20 percent twenty dollars that's it four units again it's always four units four units no, so no matter what the color is all right so we'll do start with a five dollar don't pass there's our $10 no four with a $1 big. Let's see how this goes. And let's do the same thing. So there's 25. There's 50. All right, 65. And we're looking for... Oh, I'm going to have to adjust it. All right, so craps, two craps on the come out roll. So that's going to... Pay us a nickel, so we'll take that. All right, so we are looking for $120 total, and we're out. Okay, so coming out. Three, one, four, three, one, four. All right, so that's down on that. Going to lose our big, and we're going to go back out for $10 down here. It's weird because I never played at this level. All right, here we go. For a big red, so five, three, two. Eight, five, three. Six, four, two. Seven, six, one, we're all done. All right. Okay, so that's going to give us back our ten dollars. We've got one unit on the two and one unit flat. Go back out for our no four. Ten dollars. Here we go. Six hard six on the six off on our leg. Six easy six. That is our point though. So we're lose that nickel go back up for a nickel back on our don't for 10 six again easy six all right so we're on a six off on our leg i mean it the, the probabilities are the same the strategy is the same five four nine so there's no reason you can't play it at a lower level you just have to be satisfied with a lower win rate right you're only playing for a hundred bucks 
20 bucks. Pretty good. Still a nice lunch. All right, 10, 6, 4. Six hard six. Oh, he's easy and hard. I'm knocking us off. And that's what I said yesterday or whatever that uh, if you see a lot of sixes and eights. Well, you know, you still have a you still have a probabilistic advantage with those, but it's pretty much a coin toss. All right, uh, so that's a hard ten. So we're off on our leg. Here we go. And there's a six again. All right, we've seen the sixes. Let's see a seven. There's a nine. So again, I think it's totally scalable. Oh my goodness, it's four ten. Today is a grind, though. My goodness. All right, so we're off. Back on our leg. We're down fifteen dollars. Back out for a nickel. He is disciplined. Just stick with it. Five four nine. Off on our lay. Looking for that big red. There's a 10. And there's a 9. 6, 3, 9. Alright, so we lost another one. So we're down 20 bucks. We're down what we we're trying to win. And we got a Dig ourselves back out. There's the three craps. I'm just going to get one of them back. We can get a two craps. We go with our three. Nope, got a six, two, eight. Right. So we're off on our way. Got to be some sevens in there. There's one of them. Four, three. All right, so it's going to give us another one back. Back on our lay four, come out. And we got a 10. So we're on the 10, off on our lay. Look at the big red. We've got a four. And we got a 10. Son of a beehive. All right. So we're off the 10, we're going to lose that nickel back. And there's a nickel back there. And back on our A4. 12 box cars that mean anything to us on the dark side. And we got an 8 by 3. So if this goes too long, it's going to be too long of a video. I'll just have to stop it short and I'll just put in the comments how I end up. All right, uh, five, doesn't mean anything to us. Off on our lay. That would mean something if I get that stupid four on. Forgot to tell the dealer to take me down. Eleven, yo. Take the big red. Box car. Dice are rolling in any particular session. Five, three, two. Nine, six, three. Three, one, four. Come on, big red. Four again. Ten. Getting either end. Staying out of that middle one. There you go. Twenty bucks again. Three 
one four. So we lost another ten bucks on that one. And we'll put ten bucks down here. Dice off the table. Seven out. Alright, so we'll get our ten bucks back on that one. Set back on the four. Coming out. Come on. Get a point and give me some big red. Six, four, ten. Normally I'd be happy about the ten on the dark side. Been hitting those damn things. So. Come on. Show me that seven. It's two, one, three crafts. Nine, meter. Five, four. Seven out. All right, so there's another nickel back. Back on our lay. Seven, come out seven. That's painful. It costs us a dollar. Another come out seven. Ah, so I was worried about damn seven. We're gonna whack us in the freaking come out. Another dollar. Six, five, one. Off on our lay. Nine meter. Four, three, one. Nine. Again. Six. Son of a six. All right. Point hit. Six again. What a surprise. Not. All right. It doesn't seem to matter. We're hitting the freaking tens. There's a hard four. Six. Six. Point hit. Nickel down. 25 bucks. Three craps. Nickel back. Nine. Five, four. Off on our lay. On a nine. Eight. Six, two. Yo, the eleven. Seven out. Okay. Get a nickel. Back on our lay four. Easy peasy. Six. That damn six. Got enough sixes in my life. I don't need any more sixes. Here we go. Big red. Nope, six, right back again. All right, back to twenty dollars down. Play four, here we go. Eight, oh. sister number. All right, off the four. Five. Seven out. Six one. All right. Nickel. Lay four. Still down fifteen bucks. Ten. All right. Let's see if ten is going to do us any good again. Not really helping us today. Seven. There we go. Four three. All right, 
right, so that's another nickel. Now if I come out seven, so. oh, I forgot to put my lay. I'm gonna assume my lay is out there. All right, toss me a buck. Another come out seven. Another buck. Three press. That's a nickel. Four. That's not. That's not nice. All right. So now we lost ten on that. Ten on odds. Here we go. We won four, so we lost that one. Okay, so we're going to lose another 15, so then we're down 30 over there. And then we're going to have to dig into our pile here. Yo, 11, that's not what we want to see on the don't side. Six, that's not really what we want to see here today. Big red. Eight. Yeah, I'm definitely going to run out of tape on this one. Three, two, five. Three, two, five again. But again, it would be the same whatever you're playing nickel, quarter, whatever. Four. Four again. Nine here. Six. What a surprise. So we got 10, 20, 30, 40 bucks down. Almost half our bankroll. Seven, come out seven, lovely. Toss us a check. Yeah, another come out seven. Stick to the straight line. Oh my goodness, three in a row. Are you kidding me? Four in a row. I knew they were in there, not coming out at the right time. Six. Oh boy. I'm thinking today might be a washout. I don't know. We'll see. Off the four. Five. Beaver. Seven out. Four, three, off on the six, get a nickel for that, back on our four, eight, the sisters, off on our four, yo, yo, eleven. Welcome to the grinding portion of our show today. Six. That's a surprise. Come on, Big Red. I know you're in there. Come on out and play. Another box cars. Box cars. Eight. Eight. Alright, point hit. 
10, 20, 35. Mill four, nickel. Eight again. Off on our lay. Seven out. Seven. Cost us a buck. Six. An old friend, six. Off on our way. Ten. We'd rather, rather be sitting on the ten than sitting on the six. And I got I got my wish, but not the way I wanted it. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna leave that nickel back out again, back out on our lay four, eight, sixes and eights, not great, ten, we're gonna clicky clack on that one. Four. Three. Six, five, one. Seven out, four, three. Six four. Here's our six one. Nickel. Six. Hard six. Seven out, six one. Nickel, lay four. Nine, six three. Off on our lay. Seven out. Fever. Off on our lay. Seven out. 
and again, I think that, you know, comes down to discipline. You know, you're not going in too heavy when you start to get in a hole and potentially lose it. So you have to grind it back and just wait for the probability, you know, random to change. All right, so back on our lay four, there we go. Hopefully we can make some progress, come out seven, it doesn't help us. Dollar. And we got a nine. Six, three. Better than a six or an eight. Hopefully. Let's see what the dice tell us. There's a two, two preps. Hey guys, the eyes of November. Eight, six, two. Four, three, seven, out. Okay. Is that nickel? And we're back out on our lay four. There's a weak one. Three of those, three preps. We take it. That's a nickel. Oh. No roll. Dice off the table. Cars. Eight, six, two. Seven out. Back in the sink of things. All right. Four. Ten dollars in our big, and we're gonna go ten dollars on our odds. There we go. Nine. Big red. Randomize those things. Come on, Scott. Six. Seven out. All right, so we're gonna get a quarter or a quarter. Nickel there and nickel there. Put those back in our rack. We got another quarter, another dollar for our big. All right, here we go. Coming out. Seven. Come out seven. That's gonna cost us a buck. Nine, six, three, nine. All right, off. Six, four, two. Four, one, five. Four. Hard four. Big red. Three, one, four again. That's a four. Three fours in a row. If I didn't have discipline, I'd be laying that four like crazy right now. Look at that, another four. Seven, six, one, seven, out. All right, so that's going to be, that's basically back to even. And I think I'm going to call it even for today, just because my back's starting to hurt, and this is just taking too damn long. So we got it, we were able to grind it back to even. And I'm just going to call this session a wash. Got five bucks here, one, two, three, four, five. Leave that for the dealers, whether they want it or not, I don't give a shit. 
one, two, three, four, five. There's twenty-five, fifty, seventy-five, one hundred dollars there. That's what we started with. That's what we're going to go home with. And we'll come back another day. All right. Anyway, thanks for watching. That was the session for today. It wasn't a washout. It wasn't a wipeout. Just a blah. I mean, with all those sixes and all those hits. But again, we were able to grind it back to, to net. Couldn't lose anything. So, to me, that's a good session. Thanks for watching. Scott from Paradise Preps. We'll see you on the table next time.